All right, coming up to the stage, you're gonna love her, man. She is just great. She's local. Hannah Young home, everybody. Keep it going for Ian. And one more time for Kelly, you guys. Yeah. Kelly, Kelly kind of looks like she would try to speak Spanish at Chipotle. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a joke I wrote about myself. But I'm like, you know what? I think this applies to her too. This is cool, I'm glad we're here. We got a neat little medical device. <laughs> what is that contraption? Yeah, we don't know, right? I'm 25, I've never seen that before. <laughs> 25 is a stressful age to be. It is, like, I just keep thinking about how I only have one year left on my mom's health insurance plan. <laughs> and then I have to find a new mother. <laughs> so if anyone's interested in adoption, don't all jump at once. <laughs> I, um, no, I can't replace my mom. She's so sweet and like supportive of me doing stand-up which would mean a lot more if she wasn't also so supportive of my brother rapping. Uh, growing up, I had a little issue. Uh, I was a bedwetter. Not too bad when you have a supportive mom like Bridget. She told me that the reason I wet the bed was because I was so athletic. She's like, Hannah. Hey, no. Your body is so busy at night, <laughs> growing basketball muscles, that it doesn't have time to listen to your bladder. I'd wake up just like covered in my own piss. Like, hell yeah, I bet I can dunk now. <laughs> this must be how LeBron feels. <laughs> we um, graduated college this past spring. Thank you, thank you. Uh, with a degree in anthropology. Got quiet and the police came. <laughs> I know, I thought I was majoring in a store at the mall. <laughs> then they just kept talking about fossils and shit. I, um, I didn't go to college like to learn. No, I went to college because I had just broken up with my high school boyfriend. And I was like, hell yeah, it's time to fuck. I'm gonna go explore my woman sexuality. Didn't take me long to learn that one night stands actually make me cry. <laughs> Any other cool girls in the audience this evening? <laughs> so, so, okay, we'd finish what well, he'd finish, and <laughs> I would just be like, oh my god, I bet we're not gonna hang out after this. <laughs> I never get to meet your parents. <laughs> <laughs> I was like so embarrassed about crying at first, because that's a little weird, but then I looked it up, it's totally normal, because sometimes for women, sex can release a hormone in us called disappointment. <laughs> I, I think women, we get a bad rep for being crybaby, whatever, emotional. Dudes are emotional too. It just comes out in different ways, right? Like, have you ever seen a man lose a video game? <laughs> My God. I get that Rocket League is frustrating, but it shouldn't be why you know how to drywall. comes in waves sometimes, doesn't it? <laughs> After college, I um, started taking Adderall. I got prescribed Adderall, I should say. It wasn't illegal. I know, I'm like, okay, I could have done this throughout my whole life and been like a wizard or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> my God, the whole process for getting on Adderall is so annoying. Like, this whole questionnaire, I remember one of the questions asked me if I had trouble watching movies. Like, it's my fault movies are boring. <laughs> if I wanted to watch attractive people figure things out, I would look in the mirror while I parallel park. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
my new favorite thing, uh, now that I'm on Adderall, is label making. <laughs> Any other label makers? <laughs> Maker ristas? <laughs> <laughs> so fun. My whole kitchen is so organized. And every park bench in my neighborhood now belongs to me. <laughs> it's true. Did you know if you have a label maker, your license plate tag can never expire? That's <laughs> true. A lot of you guys uh, might recognize my name. I have some work at the Cincinnati Art Museum. Thank you. Well, okay. If you own a label maker, <laughs> Anything at the art museum can belong to you. <laughs> Let's see here. I'm impulsive. I do impulsive things. Uh, like I found out how to get a credit card. Oh boy. Two months ago, got a credit card. My very first one. I'm like, holy shit, thank you, Chase Bank. I'm going to go to Bora Bora. <laughs> uh, turns out they have a limit, and sometimes it's small for certain people. So I actually ended up going to Vietnam. I did, I got back last weekend from Vietnam, believe it or not. Really beautiful country. Like I totally see why my grandpa always talks about it in his sleep. <laughs> uh, something very special happened. I got engaged. I saw who wasn't happy for me out in the audience. I saw it. I'm going to get married. I'm a fi fiance. All right, you guys are sick of my shit, huh? Dude, I can't wait to have a wedding. Honestly, this might sound basic, but like ever since I was a little girl, I just dreamt about being in charge. Just everyone I love all together under my control. Here's the thing, people. Back in the day, women, we didn't get shit when it came to weddings, right? Like, we got a husband when our dad was ready to trade us in for a goat. <laughs> so for my wedding, I'm going to make my dad dance with me to WAP. <laughs> Pussy. Eye contact! <laughs> um, I'm really excited for the wedding. I don't know if I'm excited to be married. Anyone married here? Yeah? Wow, a lot of you. What's the secret to like making it be good? Okay. Yes. Yes. No? Okay. So there is no secret, and it's not good, is what I've learned from this conversation. Any secrets? Any advice for marriage? Okay, I'm just gonna wing it then. <laughs> I have to go off what I learned from Twilight, I suppose. Come on. I don't know if my boyfriend is even a vampire or not. Like, okay. He doesn't hate blood. We just turn the lights off and lay a towel underneath. <laughs> Do you have advice on that? <laughs> no. Okay, guys. We're tired, aren't we? <sighs> we're tired and we're scared. <laughs> Wow, did I nail it? Holy shit. God. Is it my voice or my demeanor? Okay. We don't want to chat, do we? We're like, this is being recorded. I don't want to say anything wrong. All right, guys. I'll, I'll leave you with this. I, um, I have just started an Etsy account. Uh, making pretty good money selling towels. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Remember that joke you didn't like? <laughs> it's not over. I have beautiful towels for sale. They're tie-dye, they're red. I call them my clock cloths. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. I'm Hideo Cope.